Good morning everyone, um, Michael here from Classic Japanese Parts Recyclers. I picked up this Corona a couple of weeks ago, you may have seen pictures on the um, on my, my Facebook page. Um, Classic Jap Facebook page. Um, yeah, I've been trying to get it running properly and everything and I, I wanted to sell the whole car. It's got a few problems though, um, which I'll point out. Lost the windscreen on the way home, as often happens around here. Um, the air pump, which might not be a big problem to some people, is seized. So I've been running it without that. Um, playing around with the carby, trying to get that run properly. The solenoid, vacuum solenoid here to adjust the idle when it's cold, I think, um, isn't working properly. So I bypassed it, so it's getting vacuum all the time, because that normally only works when the ignition is on. Um, what else? It was overheating. Uh, I noticed it does not have a thermostat in it, or the thermostat had been gutted. I'll try to I'll flatten that, that out a bit to give it a bit more restriction and put it back in, because quite frankly I'm not spending $43 on a new thermostat for it just to test it. Radiator was severely blocked. I soaked it. I filled it up with vinegar and left it for a couple of days Flushed it out Still not happy with it. I just put some radiator flush through it then um, That I had lying around um, So I don't know. I don't know if that's going to work or not. It doesn't seem to be running hot, but I've got a leak where I took the thermostat out and I don't want to pull it apart and re and elastic it up or anything at the moment so yes, so these are the problems we've got with the engine. Um, it's a one owner car, it's pretty tidy, it's got a bit of surface rust here and there. Um, you can see it's pretty clean. There's stuff like this, you know. And the guy had been over it with a polisher, I think. The paint's pretty crappy and oxidised. Um, looks really thin on the back here. I, the, I think the guy had a go at it with the polisher a few years ago. I can see where he burnt through it on the corners of some doors. Ah, breathe, Michael, breathe. There's a, there's a spot of rust here. here. Um, that's beside the windscreen. Uh, a bit of surface rust on the bonnet. You know, um, It's a pretty tidy car. I like it. Hey? I like it a lot, actually. I'd... <coughs> If the situation was different, interior's not bad, the seats are crap, that one, and the bottom's wrecked in this, it's just all caved in, but otherwise the interior cleaned up pretty well, that was filthy as a eh? but um, yeah, it, it cleaned up pretty well, I gave it a quick, quick going over, I'm pretty happy with it, um, yeah, no, it's a nice car, but they're not really worth anything I gather, but um, it's got the 2SC engine, as you probably noticed. Um, so we've got a block radiator, a couple of issues with the carby unit running, um, thermostat. I think that's about it. I think it would go alright. Windscreen, a couple of bits of surface rust, and seats. Um, you know, but what do I want for this thing? I want, there's a bit of rust there just behind the wheel arch there. Um, I mean, I want 500 for it, really. I'll, I'll suppose I'm open offers, see how what my mood is on the day, if you get me. I don't think they're real popular, but I've noticed that there's a couple of people around who are in them, but I already had people ringing up, requesting parts from it. I said to hold off a little bit because I didn't know what I'm doing. So unless I get a decent offer over the next few days, that's going to be offered for parts. So get on to it guys, um, contact me as soon as possible if you're interested in the whole car and I can arrange a deal with transport within reason. Um, yeah, get on to me because otherwise people ask for parts, it, it's going. I'd, well, I had the thought with this, it would have been fun like if it ran well enough and I didn't have overheating issues and I didn't have to spend money on it. I would have um, put some sign writing on it and taken it to the local Carnacross Cross meetings. It would have been awesome fun. The other thing is that if I had the time and money, 
I'll probably drop a Datsun motor in it just for funnies. <laughs> like an L-series in there, I think it'd fit in pretty well. That'd be awesome. People would wonder why and everything. Well, you know, you use what you've got lying around. What am I going to do, go and buy another 2SC or try and fit the 22R in there? I don't know. I don't see much point. It'd be fun. I think it'd epitomise, um, you know, classic Jap recyclers. doing something weird like that anyway there you go guys there's a car um, I could put a million pictures online here's a video for you instead do things a little bit different you can you can see what it's like I don't have to respond to 5,000 messages I just told you I still will because nobody will listen to me and nobody will watch the video and Oh, you got a Krona, are you wrecking it? I'm waiting for that. In the guards here. Been off for some reason, it's cleaning the boot. Right, so, beautiful. Yeah, very underrated car, I think, these things. You know, everybody I know is own one, sees how good they are, but... Yeah. It's something I'd like to play with. <laughs> Just about everything I get here I'd like to play with. Um, there you go guys, um, already probably rambled on for about five minutes too long to hold everybody's attention, but five speed, two litre, carby job, two S engine, um, what else do I tell you about, it was one owner, um, pretty straight and rust free, it's a nice car, too bad it's not more desirable. Everything seems reasonable on it. Anyway, get on it guys, try and save it. Or I'll part it out for you, whatever. Cheers.